the thing that's like really cool about film school, you all, is like forget proving to anyone that you've done the homework. Use each assignment as an opportunity to make something that delights you. Your teacher may hate it, but don't prove to me that you shot 15 shots. I don't care. I can't even tell you how many thousands of shots I've shot that none of you will ever see. It doesn't matter. What matters is like I shot some shots that are worth looking at. So all that time and energy you put in, like I think sometimes we like, I mean, I did this thing once where I filmed with people who had been on death row and they were found innocent and they did this walk, this 32 mile walk from the prison in Illinois to Chicago. And because I, I, I wanted all of them to feel seen, I walked with all of them. I walked 32 miles in freezing weather. I filmed all of it. It was like carrying a huge beta cam. I like, it was so painful, so hard. I was really happy to be with those men. And I had these like amazing conversations with them. And then when we were editing the film, I wanted to put in all the footage. And the editor was like, you know what? I don't care how far you walked. I don't care how cold it was. We can only use three shots of this. And I thought back and I said, listen, you know, death row is about duration. It's about time. It's about pain. And we made that sequence longer. But it was a back and forth between me and the editor who hadn't been there, who didn't care how many shots I'd shot, didn't care how hard it was to do, just cared about what was on the screen. So viewers will go with you anywhere, but you have to lead them. You have to teach them to watch your movie, right? So like in camera person, you see like, there's a really boring shot of an open field that is a car going by that opens the movie. It's a really boring shot. And then another car goes by and you're kind of like, wow, what am I doing in this movie? It's really slow. And one of our purposes was to slow the audience down and say yeah. like, don't expect this movie is going to be fast. But then it was, we will reward you. We just rewarded you with a bolt of lightning we just rewarded you with a crash of thunder. We just re rewarded you with someone's sneeze. That, so, so we did something really unexpected after we'd done two unexpected things. So it, it makes you as the audience be like, oh, this is going to be worth it. They're going to make me slow down, sit through things, and then things are going to happen, right? And we spent a long time figuring out how much time do we make the audience wait? Will we lose people? Will we not? Okay, we're going to use this as a credit sequence so the people who are bored to death by this have something to hang on to, you know? Um, so we were playing with all of those things well aware of, like, the audience, like, they don't have time for this. Like, you got to give them reason to stick with you.